The origins of candle pin bowling, while cloaked in uncertainty, are believed to date back to the late 19th century. In the year 1880, in the city of Worcester, Massachusetts, they bore witness to the birth of this amazing sport, thanks in part to the ingenuity of Justin White, the proprietor of a local bowling establishment. White's brainchild featured elegantly tall pins and compact portable bowling balls designed to challenge and hone the skills of its participants. The moniker Candle Pin pays homage to the pins themselves, which bear a striking resemblance to slender, flickering candles. Unlike its bowling counterparts, Candle Pin Bowling stands as a testament to the traditions and culture of New England itself. It sets itself apart from its more renowned cousin, Ten Pin Bowling, through a series of very distinctive features to the game. First, the pins. Picture stately, elegant, tall, slender pins. It's a stark contrast to the stout, robust pins used in Ten Pin Bowling. Then there's the ball's dimension and weight. You can feel the difference as you grasp a smaller, lighter candle pin bowling ball free of finger holes. It has a very unique sensation and grip. And it rolls unique, too. Picture it kind of like bocce or patonk, how that ball is, but a little bit bigger. And it's different, so it's not really anything like it, but it's kind of close. <laughs> Let's just sort that out as an interesting thing for another time. Take a look at the scoring. Immerse yourself in the scoring system. Each frame grants three rolls at a perfect score of 30. Achieving a strike in a single roll or a spare in two it takes skill and precision. The cumulative score tells the story of each frame's triumphs and near misses. The pins, they do reset. There's a choreography of manual pin setters arranging and setting pins after each roll. It's a huge contrast to the automated mechanisms of 10-pin bowling. And then there's the lanes. Oh, you can't overlook that. There's an intimacy to candle pin bowling lanes. They're narrower than 10 pin counterparts, and there's no gutters. Candle pin bowling isn't just a sport. It's a journey through time and an homage to tradition. Its rich history and unique gameplay have captivated generations of New Englanders, endearing it as a cherished regional tradition that continues till this day. These are Interesting Things with J.C.